Hey guys, <clears throat> good morning, top of the morning to you. This morning, we'll be showing you guys how to replace a mobile home shower faucet. Now, originally, I had intend to repair the faucet, but when I went, it was in such a bad, grungy condition that I decided to just replace it all together. This is it. Um, this faucet that we will be replacing or the faucet that you'll be needing if you're, you're ready to repeat, replace your faucet. You go down to Lowe's and they'll have it and it'll specifically say for mobile home. This is the box. It should look like this because if you're going to install a shower faucet in a mobile home, it's different from other shower faucet because of the connections in the wall. Um... It will just mark mobile home shower faucet right there, or Lowe's product. Uh, we'll start by, uh, as I said, to repair a leaking faucet, you'll change this piece or the black rubber gasket around it, or this small black rubber gasket. So if your faucet is leaking, most likely this is the problem, and you can replace them by unscrewing the, the knobs to the faucet. But in this case, we're going to just go ahead and replace the entire faucet. And you'll start by finding your access panel, which is behind the... Excuse me, I got the order of this video wrong. This is the access panel. When you find the access panel, you should be able to... The, the connections to the faucet. You'll see the connection to the faucet. It should be three connections. And you'll unscrew them and your old faucet will come free. And then you'll pass through the new faucet through the old connection ports, just like you see me did in, in the video. And then you'll proceed to put on your washers. And the washers is important. Don't lose them. Don't forget them. They, they hold the faucet firm in place, the wall, so it doesn't stress the drywall. After you put on your washer, you want to introduce a little bit of Teflon tape to the situation to create a watertight seal. <clears throat> so, if you can remember, the three steps is finding the access port, disconnecting the three connections, which your main water have to be turned off, of course. So, you turn off the main, find the access port disconnect the tree connection to the faucet which is hot coal and shower you'll add teflon tape like you see me doing here you'll tighten each port or connection to a water seal tight you'll turn on your water and test and water life i tell you people life if you like this video like subscribe comment